So a guy walks into a bar. <laughs> that guy was me last night. <clears throat> that guy was me last night. And I order a drink. Barkeep shoves it my way. It's got two straws in it. And I was like, ah, you know, the whole skip the straw bit. But I have a little bit of a concern with skip the straw. And this barkeep comes right at me. Because, of course, skip the straw, admirable campaign. Um, but, you know, it's, it's a very small percentage of the plastic that's out there. And in fact, the sheer fact that we are finding straws in the beach cleanups shows that that's a pretty durable plastic and it's not breaking down. So the barkeep comes back to me and says, hey, listen, you know, you, we need to be focusing on a much bigger portion of the plastics. Skip the straw is almost a distraction. So what do you say to a barkeep who comes back at you with that? And how do you, you know, what's the teachable moment? Or is it, or is he right? So I would argue that he's not right. <laughs> so, um, yeah, skip the straws are what we consider one of the, the low-hanging fruit to get a foot in the door to talk about the larger message. So, you're right, straws, while they are um, not necessarily the most commonly found thing on, on beach cleanups, they are up there on the list. Um, so, and I would say that if the argument was that they don't break down, well, we don't want them to break down. And so, but we also... Um, don't want them whole in the environment either. Plastic does not belong in the environment. So any plastic that's there is bad. And I think skip the straws are a great way to help raise awareness <coughs> about the issue as a whole. So making sure that it's not necessarily a conversation just about the straws, but about marine debris as a whole. And also um, what we found in terms of when businesses get on board, um, these skip the straw campaigns that are happening nationally, um, it's also seen as an economic benefit for them because they are saving money by not using as many straws. So what we found in businesses um, that are, they always have straws in hand, so we're, we're careful that you know, we don't want to discriminate against somebody who, who needs a straw, right? Mm -hmm. So the uh, idea is you offer a straw on request. It's what most businesses that, that do this give a straw campaign do. Some uh, even provide alternatives, maybe that aren't plastic, but are paper or metal or, or things like that. Um, and what they found is a, a savings to them on the small business level of saving in terms of, of plastic straw buying. Yeah. So, when I walked 